It is now winter, and Boreas begins to fill his cheeks with breath, shaketh the tops of the high cedars, and hoiseth the waves of the sea, to the danger of the sailor's comfort. Now is the earth nipped at the heart with a cold, and her trees are disrobed of their rich apparel. There is a glass set upon the face of the waters, and the fishes are driven to the bottoms of the deep. The usurer now sits lapped in his furs, and the poor makes his breath a fire to his fingers' ends. Beauty is masked for fear of the air, and youth runs to physic for restoratives of nature. The stag roars for loss of his strength, and the flea makes his castle in the wool of a blanket. Cards and dice now begin their harvest, and good ale and sack are the cause of civil wars. Machiavel and the devil are in council upon destruction, and the wicked of the world make haste to hell. Money is such a monopoly that he is not to be spoken of, and the delay of suits is the death of hope. In itself it is a woeful season, the punishment of nature's pride and the play of misery. Farewell.'